Today we are going to be going over how to get a weld at the start of your banner. So as some of you may be experiencing right now, um, you might have a little bit of a lip at the end, uh, an inch, maybe a little less, something that looks like this. What I'm going to show you is how to get rid of that and how that is is loading the material in with the weld rollers down in the pinch position. You're going to crease it over and push it between the gap right there. Then you're just going to start like normal. It's going to pick it up and you'll see after this that we have a weld right at the very beginning. This helps when you're doing four-sided banners. It makes it easy for the material to go through the guide. Now we're going to use the same technique but with our pocket guide. First I'm going to lower the weld rollers, then insert the material, fold it over in the guide, get everything nice and squared, push it against the weld wheels, and then start welding. And now as we look at the beginning, you're going to see we have a weld right at the beginning. We use the same technique for acrylic welding as well. So I'm going to bring down the tape, throw it through the guide, Now the only difference with this acrylic is that I'm going to put the tape underneath the weld wheel and then close it. Now I'm going to put some tension on the tape to get it nice and straight. I'm going to throw the bottom layer material in, push it up, then we're going to do the same with the top panel. And once you get in position, get your hands to a safe location. and start welding. Weld right at the tip. 